Yo, what's up, guys? It's your boy Materialized or Jax Black Eagle with another motherfucking video. And, um, you guys are probably wondering what the hell are you doing? And why are you driving a BMW i3? Well, 135i. That's right, guys. I'm driving a BMW 135i in Minecraft Xbox right now. Isn't that crazy? But don't worry. I'm sure all of you guys want to get this car as well, and I'm going to show you exactly how to do so. So, if you do go to enjoy this video, guys, my Xbox is absolutely destroying itself. Um, <laughs> but uh, if you guys do go to enjoy the video, make sure to smash the like, hit that subscribe button, and don't forget to comment down below and let me know if this video helped you guys out. But let's go ahead and get right into it, guys. Okay, guys, so to start this off, you're going to need four apps. Um, you're gonna need a file downloader, file explorer, Microsoft Edge, and UFO.transfer. Um, by default, Xbox already has file explorer and Microsoft Edge on it, I believe. So you're really only gonna need to go and download file downloader and UFO.transfer, um, which is super easy. They're both free. They don't cost anything. Head over to the apps, download these, and the next thing we're gonna have to do is go ahead and hit the middle button on your Xbox. Go over to settings. Go down to display and sound. Go to video output, go to video fidelity and overscan, and go over to overscan border and make sure the box is unchecked. Um, if you have it like this, make it to where it looks like that and there's no check inside of it. And after that, we can get straight into it. After you get that done, you're going to want to go ahead and load up into Microsoft Edge. So once you guys have actually loaded up into Microsoft Edge, you're going to want to go ahead and type in this link right here now this is the link you guys are going to want to type um, it is all right there you're going to want to type in this exact link um, onto your into your um, search bar up top you're going to type in this exact link I'll go ahead and pause it for you you guys can go ahead and pause the video right here if you want to and um, go ahead and type this in your search bar and then come back when you're done but for everybody that has already typed this in and has already paused the video and typed this in let's go ahead and get right into it so once you guys have typed that in you're gonna wanna go and hover over this download button right here and you're going to press the pause button on your controller which is also the three lines in the middle of the controller and you're gonna wanna go down to copy link select copy link and then go ahead and hit the middle button again from here guys go back to your games and apps go back to your games and apps and you're gonna go into file downloader file downloader is the one with the silver thing here so go ahead and go into file downloader and from here guys you're gonna click the three lines in the top left corner and you're gonna go to from URL once you guys are on from URL yours is gonna be blank what you're gonna wanna do is come down here guys you're gonna come down here select local storage click this search bar press B and then press the pause button after you've done that guys I'll explain that one more time because that parts a little bit confusing you're gonna come up here select this bar you're gonna hit B once you guys have selected this bar up here select B then hit the pause button and hit paste once you guys have done that, you're not going to have any of the stuff that I have on here, but you're going to go ahead and come down here and hit this right arrow. Once you guys hit that right arrow, come down here and hit start. So once you guys have hit start, this is going to download pretty quickly. Come back up here one more time, hit the three arrows and go down to storage. Once you guys get to storage, you're not going to have any of this stuff that I have here, but what you're going to want to go ahead and do guys is you're gonna want to go and you're gonna want to click on the thing you guys just downloaded now this is what it's gonna look like for you guys but what you want to do is click the checkbox right here when you click this you're gonna come down here to the bottom right corner and you're gonna select these three dots when you select the three dots you're gonna come up here to rename select rename and all you're gonna do is hit the RB button all the way over to the end and you're gonna do dot zip dot z i p 
and you're gonna hit B and then you're gonna hit OK for me I already have one of these so it's gonna tell me to choose another name but that is what you're gonna do you're gonna hit the check mark come down here to the three dots select that hit rename and then just type dot zip at the end of it and whenever you do that it's gonna make it into a zip folder therefore you can go ahead and double click it and actually open it up and see the things inside so once you guys have done this what you're gonna do from here is go ahead and select both of these things now once you have selected both of these you're gonna wanna come down here to the bottom right select the three dots and you're gonna wanna hit copy once you guys have hit copy go ahead and hit the up button after you've hit the up button you're gonna come up here click the search bar hit B come down to the bottom right to where these three dots are and then hit new folder but what you're gonna do first is actually pick a title for the folder for me I'm gonna type in BMWW therefore I already have a BMW folder you can actually name it BMW car whatever you guys want to name but I'm gonna name it BMWW because I already have a BMW folder so once you guys have done that hit B come to the bottom right and hit new folder this is gonna make a new folder for you and once you're in this folder you're gonna go ahead and come down here and hit this icon right here what this icon is is the paste icon and it's gonna paste both the uh, behavior folder and the resource folder directly in here now that you guys have pasted this in here what you're gonna to want to do from here is go ahead and hit the middle button on the controller go to your games and apps and you're gonna to want to go to ufo.transfer once you guys have loaded into ufo.transfer it's gonna look like this right here you're gonna come up to the right here and if you guys did not follow that step earlier to where you unchecked that box this will not be here for you so go ahead and go and do that now but what we're gonna do is click on the gear and you're gonna go to open in file explorer select open in file explorer and you're gonna go to the top here and select packages once you guys have selected packages you're gonna come and do megascopes.universal file and if you can't see this make sure your thing is on newest on top and you're gonna come and click megascopes.universal file once you guys have clicked that you're gonna go and do local state click on local state and you're gonna come and you're gonna see your folder that you just made in here now I have a lot of different folders but the one you guys are gonna be looking at is BMWW what you're gonna do is go ahead and come in here click that folder you're gonna come in there you're going to hover over one of these we're gonna do resource pack first so you're gonna hit the pause button while you're hovering over that and come down here and hit copy once you've done that go up to the top and hit packages again once you've done that scroll through until you find Microsoft Minecraft UWP console once you've found that go ahead and select it by pressing a from there you're gonna go to local state games com.mojang and then you're gonna have to go ahead and make some new folders here so the first folder since we're doing resource pack you're gonna come to the bottom down here and select this icon right here when you do that you're gonna go ahead and do resource underscore packs now do resource resource underscore packs and make sure you do it exactly as I do it otherwise it will not work so you're gonna do resource underscore packs hit B and then hit OK now I have two resource underscore packs folder so I'm gonna go ahead and delete that and once you have created that folder guys you're gonna want to go ahead and go down here again do this and then you're gonna want to do behavior underscore packs so do behavior underscore packs so once you guys have done that go ahead and hit that and hit OK as I did spell behavior wrong just now I apologize you're gonna wanna spell it just like this one let me delete that 
you're going to want to spell it just like this one here behavior underscore packs once you guys have that done as we did copy our resource packs to er our resource earlier we're going to click in resource packs and go ahead come down here and hit this little icon right here now what this is going to do is paste your resource that you just copied earlier from the BMW add-on in here now for us we already have one so I'm gonna delete this one but this is what it should look like the only thing you should have in here is that BMW add-on now once you have that in there guys you're gonna come back up here one more time click local state and then click packages one more time once you've done that go back to megascopes.universal file go to local state Go to the folder you created earlier and copy the behavior pack. Once you guys hover over it, press the pause button and hit copy. From there, click packages again. Go find your Minecraft again. Local state, games, com.mojang. And then you're going to go to behavior underscore packs, the folder that you guys just made a little bit ago. Like I said before, I already have one of those in here. But you're going to go ahead and go down to this icon right here and hit that. And it's going to paste this directly in there. But now that we have that, we already have one. I'm going to go ahead and delete this. And what you're going to do from here, guys, is go ahead and load up your Minecraft. Okay, okay, guys. Once your game is completely loaded up, meaning your skin has lo your skins and everything have loaded up fully, um, you're going to go ahead and hit play. And you're gonna load into a world now the world that you well before you're gonna go ahead and hit play you're gonna hit create new world and when you hit create new world you're gonna come down here and you're gonna go ahead and select resource packs and as you can see your BMW 135i is gonna be right there so what you can do is hit a hit the plus button go down to behavior packs hit a and hit the plus button when you do that hit ok and then hit continue so once you guys have done that go ahead and back on out now I'm not gonna create a new one all you're gonna do is launch that world up okay guys so what you're actually gonna do to get this item is I suggest you guys going into creative on your world and then um, whatever world you guys want to get these cars on go into creative on your world spawn one in and then set it back to survival but i'm going to show you guys exactly how to get these into your inventory and be able to place them just like this right here so what you're going to want to go ahead and do is open up your inventory on creative and you're going to want to go up to the search bar here now once you guys sorry about that once you guys have gone to your search bar you're going to want to type in b m w and once you guys type in BMW, you're going to notice this logo right here pops up. Go ahead and select that. And you can then place down as many cars as you feel the need to do. Just like that, guys, that is all you have to do. If you guys did go and enjoy this video, make sure to smash that like button. Hit the subscribe button down below, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Let me know in the comment section down below if you guys enjoyed this video and you want more Minecraft tutorials like this. Um, but regardless, I hope I was able to help you guys out in some way and you guys enjoy driving this thing around. Even though you can just hear your pitter patter of your feet <laughs> running super fast. But I think it's actually super cool the fact that you can get a car in Minecraft. Like that's so insane to me. Especially on Xbox. But um, I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out guys.